Now, after it was originally canceled due to safety concerns, a drag story hour was held in Enfield this morning. 22 News reporter Kaylee Collins breaks down the controversy leading up to the event. A drag story hour held in Enfield on Saturday, stirring up some strong emotions. And we can't sit back and watch. We don't like it, and we're not just going to sit back and watch this. Children shouldn't be exposed to that kind of behavior. Who am I to judge you? Who are you to judge me? Who are they to judge any of us? The storytelling event was supposed to be held back in January at the Enfield Public Library, but was called off due to perceived threatening comments made on social media. After that cancellation, supporters of the Drag Story Hour were looking for a new location to host the show with some increased security. They decided on as Nuntuck College. They said that they were going to be able to provide all of the security needs that we had. And, you know, I wanted to make sure that there was not any kind of problem with uh, children, that we didn't want children to have to uh, experience uh, this kind of thing inside a building that we couldn't control. While the drag story hour went quietly uninterrupted inside the building, it was a different environment outside. We're taking a stand for righteousness because we're it's sad to us. Educate yourself, you know, attend one. So I'm here to be a voice and support so the, these young families with their young kids can come to a drag story hour in peace. 24 families registered for Saturday's event with 25 on a waiting list to attend future story times. Queer space is so important for all ages in the queer community, right? That uh, children, youth, adults need to know that uh, they are represented, they are supported and they are loved. Working for you in Enfield, Kaylee Collins, 22 News.